guys, this is my wonderful people. Guys, welcome to this channel. Guys, I don't know what in the apple for Nigeria. I don't know what in the apple. They do us. Why is it that Nigeria cannot stand by the tooth? If you say something, if they say something, they cannot just stand by it. If the heat starts, they can't just stand by it. It's still the case of Mobad. Late Mobad, the late singer. I can remember when Iyabo and Tonto Dike, they were at the forefront of this seeking justice for him. They said a lot of things. They were pointing fingers. They were even the one saying, Ki Naremali, Samlari, hold them, bring them, attack them, swallow them, slaughter them. They were the ones saying all these things. A lot. Even the Solomon, they were saying so many things. They, were, they weren't... They weren't even talking about any other person. They were just pushing the narrative to Sam Larry and Naramali. Guys, guess what? Now that Naramali is back and the interrogation has been done, no evidence of him having hands in the death of Mobad, he decided to pick up a sue to sue anybody for the formation of character. Anybody or those people that were saying he was the one or he wasn't like he decided to sue them. Do you know that everybody on the talk and other thing? Nobody's like they are not denying the fact that they never said something about that. If you've not watched the video of Iyabo saying that he, she never like recently she's denying the fact that she never said that Narimali killed Mobad. She is denying it. Like she's saying she never said so that she was just asking a question. She never said or pushed the narrative that um it was Narimali or Sam Larry. She was just saying that since Samari is close uh, since Sam Larry is close to Nar uh, Narimali that they should ask him question. He when Nigeria even the the Solomon that even said it on in an interview. He has come out with a post that he never said something of that nature that he didn't say that Narimadi killed Mobad. What is happening? Like, so this one is like one person is now like is against like is this one is one man squad. Like this only one person is facing how many people on top of waiting him to like even if he never had the hand in, in the death of the guy. But you 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 oppress the guy to an extent, to an a point of depression. You, you you torture the guy, so you have a hand indirectly or directly. You have a hand. So those people that is denying the fact that I don't know you denying what you said. I don't understand. Must we all show that we are from Nigeria? Must we possess the Nigerian character in all ramification? Doesn't make sense. You are saying you are seeking justice for this boy, or you never seek any justice, which means you guys were just playing with us. We are just catching crews with this, the death of the boy. Yes, because definitely you guys have covered the truth. Because all of you, you covered the truth and pushed the narration to Naramali and Samlari. Now they are back to sue all those people because there is no evidence that he killed the boy. You guys are now withdrawing. You are not saying that no, that's him biting your mouth. He's never done. I don't think this is fair, honestly. It is not fair. It wasn't justice that you guys were seeking. Guys, let me know what you think about this Iyabo and Solomon denying the fact that they never said that Narimali killed Mobad. Of which they said, we have proof of it. But they are denying it. They never said it. Guys, let me know what you think about it. And don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to our channel, the Ogwenge channel, Nigel TV, which is a wonderful person, guys. Stay tuned to this channel. Bye, guys.